you're like me, obviously. I have very big hair. Humidity wreaks havoc on your hair. So here to take our locks from lackluster to luscious, we have hairstylist to the stars, Trey Gillen from Via Matari Salon. He's also my hairdresser, gets credit for the hair today. You. you know, we're talking humidity and I'm a meteorologist as well. And what happens to the hair when you have the humidity, the hair being so porous, it just absorbs all that moisture, That's right? right? And you know what? You won't have a problem in Houston anymore because I'm here to help <laughs> Help you. Okay, so Houston, Thank we God. no longer have a problem with humidity. <laughs> so, but especially for those folks that do have chemically processed hair, yes. humidity is even worse, right? Yes. So when you color your hair and blow dry your hair, your scales get raised, and that allows all the humidity in easier. And then the humidity takes your hair and brings it back to your natural state, not the state you want it to be in. And that's how frizz happens. So I Let's have some Let's start with the products. hot tools then. Yeah, so the hot tools, this is going to be great um, information because most people don't realize what tourmaline, nano, and ionic mean, ceramic means. Like so, you're standing there going, which one do I buy? Right, exactly. So nano and ionic means smaller particles that help put moisture in the hair. The ionic part, they kind of attach to your hair and either help it to lay down smooth or if it's a positive ion, it helps it to get volume. So negative ions give you smoothness, positive ions give you volume. And newer blow dryers will have a positive or negative switch on it. So if you want the volume, you turn it to positive. If you want the negative, you switch it to a negative ion. So if you have straight hair, then would you switch it to the positive? If you want volume, okay. yes. And if you want that straight smooth look, you keep it on negative. Most blow dryers though will have a negative ion system. And also that can blow dry your hair faster up to 40% because the ions help get the water out of the hair. It breaks down the water molecule and disperses it out of the hair faster. So make sure you're looking you're looking for the right tools then, the right, right hot tools. There's another thing on there they're called tourmaline. Tourmaline is a precious stone that when heated up naturally emits negative ions. And you see that with a lot on what the, the straighteners yes. and the curling irons. It'll say tourmaline technology. So that can make it a little bit more expensive because it is a precious stone. So it will up your cost of the product. So that's going to mean on, on the actual flat Flat, bed of the, the flat, flat iron. irons, curling irons, hot rollers, and also in the blow dryer, in the coils, there'll be tourmaline in there. And that is that will, what gives it a little bit of a sparkle? Uh, that's the ceramic. So oh, okay. ceramic <laughs> is actually going to change the infrared heat, which is very aggressive on your hair, to far infrared heat. And that makes it a much gentler heat. It's still just as hot, just not as aggressive going into your hair. So you definitely want ceramic, and it's the amount of ceramic that it's been um, put in the product that makes it work. Okay, so, so those three things are the things you want to look for. Ions, nano, tourmaline, and the fourth one is ceramic. Okay, so now we have our hot product. Yeah. Let's move into to putting some of the styling products to work. Yeah, so we're going to start, this is my, my model, Madeline, and we're going to start with smoothing the hair. So let's say you get home, Madeline, and you worked all day and you just want to smooth out your hair before you go out. One of the easiest things you can do is take a shine serum. This shine serum has panthenol in it and panthenol is going to add a lot of moisture to your hair. And when your hair is getting frizzy, it's craving that moisture, especially if it's color treated. So putting a couple of pumps in your hair, just working from the ears down, will be a great way to kind of get the split ends under control. So and you do not put shine. this directly on the scalp. You go ears down on the hair. On dry hair, it could make the hair look greasy. So you definitely want to keep it from the ears down. But let's say you get home and you're tired of your hairstyle, but you don't want to start over from scratch. So a great thing you can do is take a, a product like Creme Universal by L'Oreal Professional, and you're gonna just put a little bit in your um, hair. So a little bit, you're talking what, dime size? Like dimed and nickel size for the whole head, and just put it towards the ends. And also, because of that moisture thing and the humidity, putting a product in that's anti-humid will really help fight that. Um, humidity. So it's better than just spritzing your hair down with water and starting over. You'll actually get some goodness out of it. So I've worked it through her hair and I'm just gonna take my blow dryer and my round brush and let that product do its job which is a straightening product so it's gonna smooth out her curls. Madeline has really curly hair. We blew it out really? in prep for the show 
but now I'm going to show you, you can even smooth it out even more by just adding a little bit of a smoothing product. See, you're a girl in my world. The girls with the curly hair that crave the straight hair. So yeah. Madeline looks fantastic, but what if you're somebody who just wants to get up and go? You need that quick fix. Yeah, can I do you? Yes, you can. Thanks, Madeline. <laughs> you were awesome. I really appreciate it. So I want like that, you know, the so 20 th second fix. Yeah, and this is for like going bigger and just zhuzhing what you already have, Texas, right? Texas, go big. So I'm taking a volume powder by Sasha Wan. This is my all time favorite product. It gives you volume and it's also like a dry shampoo. So this product you want to put on the roots because it'll absorb oils that collect on your scalp throughout the week. Well, or the day, depending on how often you wash <laughs> your hair. You're gonna spray it through the ends too because it's gonna help with volume. Then I like to take a little beach spray and I spritz it far, far away, not up close because you don't want to wet the hair down. Okay. That will cause problems. You want to just mist it. That's gonna kind of re structure your hair and then and you're going to right? add, <laughs> add the cold air ha. you're just going to fluff your hair i push it all forward i love the hair over the shoulders it gives it a little and you're good modern to go. feel yeah and then just kind of finger it back into place now trey let's quickly show folks at home the diy uh, yes. hair mask it's super easy to do so this is something you can do at home it's going to be um honey egg butter um, coconut oil and olive oil. Okay? okay, so we're gonna take half a stick of butter. Do you want to help me with this? Sure. And then I'll let you crack this egg. So the the butter is gonna give you fatty acids and shine and smoothness. The egg is gonna give you lots of vitamin A and prevent breakage in the hair. Okay. We're gonna add a little honey for moisture and hydration. The olive oil is gonna give you um, healthy scalp. So this is great if you have a little bit of. Dandruff. And you're adding about two tablespoons two of the tablespoons, honey that, yes. and then also of. And the then the. Coconut oil restores moisture. Oh, coconut oil is good for so many so things. So many things. It's found, all of these are found in skincare um, items as well because the same things on your skin is good for your hair. It's just different quantities of it and different um, levels of like greasiness. You know, you don't want to put anything too greasy in your hair. And you so just this mix goes, this all up. Now, yes. how long am I going to leave this on my hair at home? On dry hair, 10 to 30 minutes. I would recommend 30 minutes because it's a natural ingredient, so it's not going to penetrate tr through quickly. And then because it has eggs and stuff. It's <laughs> doing a cooking segment. Sorry to interrupt. But guys, today is Pretty actually much. Trey's <laughs> birthday. So we had to uh, get you this very Pretty dry crazy. looking muffin and a couple of cake balls to celebrate Trey. Thank you Happy so birthday. much. Sorry I to interrupt. And your segment. mama, your sweet mama is here with us yes. joining us we today love as that. well. She's yes. out in the Thank audience. You. you are so welcome. Can't wait until I, next time. I have a hair mask for you. <laughs> You know yeah. what? Next for next segment. time. I do okay. want to make sure folks know that if, when you do this at home, you want to rinse out the shampoo twice, twice and because then you're Because it'll smell like eggs. So and you know what? No good. We're putting it all up on uh, HoustonLife.tv. Uh, That's website. right. 